guys so today this video is going to be a collective haul I feel like I sound very low right now but anyway um, yeah so today's gonna be a collective haul I haven't had a video up in a couple of weeks because my birthday was on Sunday um, I went out on Saturday and then my brother's birthday was on Friday so it's been a very crazy weekend I did film last week but I never got a chance to edit those videos plus I don't like the way they came out so um, I went out to Ulta today looking for something specific and they didn't have it and come to find out they only have it at a CVS that's like in a whole different town than where I live so I have to go there and get that tomorrow but anyway I'll have a video on that later within like the next day or two because I have to have it up by a certain time but whatever um so today I went to Ulta and didn't find that item so I found two other things that I wanted um, I've been needing pore strips I haven't had them in a very long time and I have been using the formula 10 point 5.0 mask or whatever that is for pores but I don't really appreciate that burning sensation that it has and I'll have a full review on it later but yes yeah, so I wanted to pick up another mask so I got this Freeman facial revealing peel off mask in pomegranate and it just looks like this I always look at these when I'm in Ulta and I never pick them up I always end up getting little packets of the other kind of masks because I have had those before so I just kind of go with what I know but I wanted to try something new this time and I figured it's a dollar or two more so why not plus I had 350 off coupon so this really came out to being like 50 cents so like I said I needed pore strips and so I also picked those up the BR deep cleansing pore strips for your nose I have a crap load of them left over for the face so I didn't want to get the double pack so yeah I absolutely love these um not sure if I mentioned this in the beginning but this is a collective haul but you can tell from the title um so the rest of the stuff that I'm going to mention is from about a month and a half ago up until now because I've just been collecting things and I wanted to do a huge haul but I really haven't purchased that much stuff I thought I would have bought so much more but I really didn't so let's just start with that um, my favorite purchase of all, well, second favorite, is this right here. It is the Acne Free Deep Cleansing Duo, and it's a cleansing brush with, like, an acne, um, purifying cleanser. Um, I've been wanting the Clarisonic, and I've been buying a whole bunch of stuff at Ulta to get the points to get it for free, even though it's not free, since I have to buy everything else to get the points. But that's not the point. Um, but it was the cheapest one that I saw. Plus, I've been having really bad breakouts lately, so I figured that maybe that acne cleanser would do something for me instead of just getting the Olay one. So that came out to being, I think, $18.99. It was on sale. The regular price of it is $21.99 and I don't know I think it's worth it I really like the brush I use it almost every single day and yeah this is what it looks like and it comes with two brush heads and this is the cleanser right here not really a fan of it but this whole line says that it's better than proactive it's proven to be better than proactive so that's also why I chose it because I had really horrible skin when I was younger and when I used proactive it cleared my skin up really well so if this is better than that then I wanted to give it a shot plus it's a lot cheaper so the next two items I'm gonna mention I already did a review on so I'll link them down below and it's the L'Oreal Youth Co Texture Perfector day night cream and the serum this is the second one I purchased um, I love this stuff it really has made a difference in my skin but I have to constantly use it like I think I didn't use it for a week so that's why my skin got really bad and kind of crazy unless it's because I'm breaking out from using the day night cream because I think it started when I started using this um, I like it I don't think it's anything special it smells nice obviously the packaging is super cute but I don't think it's worth the $25 but I do highly recommend the face wash and the serum um, but you can steer clear from the moisturizer in my opinion I also got like I said I've been um, breaking out pretty badly so I went back to my clean and clear acne spot treatment which just looks like this and it works but it's I don't know it's really nothing special I probably shouldn't have repurchase it it does a good job but I feel like I need something stronger just because I'm very impatient even though this does work within a couple of hours I feel like I just have to keep applying it constantly to let it continue doing what it's supposed to do the next thing I bought was this NYX love and real palette this one is in the Brazilian and these are the colors that it comes with this is like a matte brown um, this is like a 
I don't know, a beige, beige, what? A beige pinky kind of color. And this one right here is more of a champagne kind of color. And it's actually on my eyes right now. I did film a get ready with me with this. Um, I just felt like filming today because it's been a very long time and I have my computer that I edit on. So I figured it would be a good day to film. So the next thing I got was this Anastasia Beverly Hills Lavish Palette. I absolutely love this palette. Um, I think everybody knows what it looks like, so I'm not going to really go into detail with it. But I love this palette. Makeup by Ali did a makeup tutorial with it, and something just told me I have to have it. So since I had a 20% off coupon, I picked this up, and I've been using it just about every single day since I bought it, and I love it. Love, love, love it. Alright, this purchase right here was a random purchase because I needed a certain amount to get to $45 so that I can get an extra 200 points. And so it's just the shaving cream with the free razor. It was $3.49 and I think I needed like $3 to get pushed over into getting the bonus points. So I just picked that up. And this is another purchase I was very excited about. This came in a duo pack. Um, this by Healthy Sexy Karen. It's the Soy Tri Wheat Leave-In Treatment and the Renewal Argan Oil. I raved about this when I had the little sample of it. I absolutely adore this oil. It just makes my hair super shiny and smooth and silky. And I think I love it better than my macadamia healing oil. Um, Price-wise, this is actually a lot cheaper. And I think you get a little bit more with this one. This one is 4.2. Oh, they get the same amount, but save a couple bucks with this. And so I would really recommend this instead of the macadamia. Just saying. But yeah, those two, when I got the package, well, when I saw it, it said that it was $19.95, but something told me to ask the girl to price check it. And when she price checked it, homegirl told me it was $6.99. Okay. The oil itself is $22, and the full-size leave-in treatment is I think 18 so a $40 value for seven dollars and then a 20% off on top of that I'm pretty sure I made out like a bandit as my mama would say so it was a really good deal and the last thing I purchased was another well a few more items from healthy sexy hair and they were buy two get one free so I needed a new hairspray and I wanted to try the soy touchable hairspray and I really do like it like a lot a lot a lot um, it holds my hair. It doesn't make it too hard and it does smell really good. It doesn't smell like your typical alcoholic hairspray. And I needed a heat protectant because I haven't had a heat protectant in months and I feel like it's been damaging my hair. My hair's been breaking off. So I picked up the So You Want Flat Hair Hot Iron Spray. And I actually got two of those because you can't have enough heat protector spray. So yeah, that's pretty much it for my collective haul. I feel like I just talked a lot in this but I kind of don't care. A haul is a haul. And I talk when I talk. And I do what I want because it's my channel, bitches. So yeah. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this haul video. Let me know what else you want to see. Um, I didn't, haven't connected my Google Plus with my YouTube channel, so I know some people haven't done it either, and they don't allow you to comment on videos if you don't do that. So um, leave me a request in messages or on Instagram or even on my Facebook. Everything should be linked down below and on Twitter too. So yeah, that's it for my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed, and until next time, I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.